Today we're gonna have some fun with this milk paint and this large cherry bowl blank. Hit it! That's what I'm talking about. Wait! Okay now, from the beginning. Hello and welcome to Wolfridge Woodworking. I'm Ed, welcome to the shop. I hope you're doing well. So what we've got today is a very large um, cherry blank. This is about 254 meter, or meters, <laughs> millimeters across or 10 inches and about 101 uh, millimeters deep or that's about uh, four inches. Um, so I'm gonna try to make a, a fruit bowl. I originally bought this to make a salad bowl out of it but I really don't think it's kind of, it's deep enough but it's just not wide enough. It needs to be at least 12 inches or more but my lathe can only do 12 inches. So anyway, um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to make a cherry uh, fruit bowl out of it um, and I want to do some uh, something different. I, I really want to check out the contrast between this um, blue moon milk paint and the the redness uh, that will darken over time with the cherry. I just I, I really I'm really curious to see what that con contrast would look like. Um, so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make just a basic bowl shape. Uh, I may put some grooves on the outside of it uh, but anyway the main thing is is to experiment and see what what it looks like when you paint the outside of a cherry blank in, in contrasting. So that's the project, hope you stick around. Let's go ahead and get started. Sorry about the noise, I got the air filter going, um, so um, just forgive me. But what I wanna do is I want the bowl to slope in a bit. Um, so I'm trying to do you know, the golden uh, rule. So I think that's what it's called. But anyway, so it's about uh, 240 uh, millimeters across. And so now this is, uh, a, you know, 66% of that is, is 150 or something like that. Don't, don't ask me math. I, I, this is what it came out to be. That's what the calculator said. Um, so this is the, going to be roughly the outside. If I can hold this one in place, this is going to be roughly the outside of the bowl. So the uh, the top is going to come to here. So that's that's the general idea. All right. And now I want to put in where the recess is going to be. Oh, 
Wow, I am really happy uh, with the way this ha this turned out. Uh, the vision I had, just it was on point. Um, what do you guys think? You know, drop a comment down below. Tell me what you think. I do like, and I know that I'm probably going to get some people that that thumbs down it because it's painted, and you know th that's okay. It's not for everybody, but you know what? My channel, I do like to experiment. Uh, so I wanted to see what it would look like with a solid color, you know, and have that contrast between the the outside color and the inside of this cherry and I gotta say it, it, it turned out really really well in my opinion um, I like the uh, the beads here that you know it's again just to break it up the blue um, I'm happy with it and I originally said that you know this could be a fruit bowl but really it could be a fruit bowl it could be a popcorn bowl it could be just a bowl that you put you know stuff in um it could be a, a dough ball the, the, you know to rise you know raise dough in it's finished with food safe products so you know it really could be used for anything so i do hope you enjoyed it if you did give it that thumbs up if you didn't that's okay give it a thumbs down um like share comment all of those good things i think i said like twice subliminal hint <laughs> uh, but anyway thank you so much um if you are new to the channel and you want to see more videos like this click right over here if you want to become a subscriber click up here click the bell so that you're notified when i upload a new video and as always i wish you and your family a blessed day thank you